Here's the treasures that are awaiting us now. Look at this pile of sh Two mirrors, cheap, thin, dollar store kind of geese. Hey guys, doing a follow-up here at the storage facility. I got the ottoman and the slats and the side rails for the bed. I've got everything organized in here. Uh, this furniture, all this is going in this corner. Uh, nice dresser, really good mattress, and uh, this, all it needs is tightening up and cleaned up. Everything over here in the corner I'm leaving behind because I went through it. It's all personal stuff. All this is uh, going to be left for the, the customer that requested this stuff, and I don't have any problem doing that. Everything you see over here is all donate. That whole section. Wall art, you can't sell it. Ironing board, you can't sell it. Lamps, you can't sell them. Okay guys, I'm back to the storage unit that I'm almost done with. Got the other vehicle here, I'm making a donation again. So that's a third load of stuff I'm donating. That's trash. And I'm gonna come back and get the dresser and all that stuff. I gotta be out of here tomorrow, so. Anyway, I'm gonna sum it up real quick. We got uh, we got a nice ottoman out there. I didn't mention that earlier, so. Uh, Oh, I might have, but anyway, it, it's probably 50 to $80 range. We'll probably get somewhere between that. We'll say 60 bucks. Bedroom suit, 300 We'll probably ask a little bit more on that and settle for three. Uh, the pub table, buck and a quarter. Uh, that's three. Uh, and the shoes. The way I see it, as I, like I said yesterday, if there's going to be any profit, <laughs> if there's to be any profit in this unit, then uh, there had to be some stuff in the boxes. And as you can see, all the boxes were kitchen stuff, not stuff we could sell. We have to have pristine stuff to sell on Cra or Craigslist. I'm sorry, we do sell on Craigslist, but we sell mainly on Facebook. And I do uh, supply stuff to uh, some uh, vendors in bulk. So we have ways of doing things, but we can't sell all the little yards. We don't do yard sale stuff. So we donate all that to Wayside. So my final summary on this locker. Da -da -da -da. We broke even, folks. Space, time, effort, money. So the effort we failed, money we failed. Space, yeah, we're fine on that. Time, it, it wasn't that bad. This is just right down the street. But we failed on this locker. This just makes me want to buy more sooner. <laughs> I'm never going to stop doing this, folks. Not not willingly. At any rate, sum it up, break even. So, sorry it wasn't an exciting money making unit. I'll have some of those. I'll have some really crappy ones, too, where I'll probably get pissed off and treat the locker like it needs to be treated. This one, this one deserves a little bit of respect. The woman c took care of her stuff and uh, what she had. Anyway, we broke even on this, guys. I will see you in the next video. Have a great day stacking. Hope you do better now. Yeah, well, we're going to put this item up today that we just got recently. We finished stocking it. This is a large 46-inch nine-drawer toolbox, totally stocked. We got DeWalt power tools, batteries, chargers, We've got DeWalt grinders, reciprocating saw, circular saws, new blades, extension cords. That's the bottom drawer. Now, moving up, plenty of craftsman tools, wrenches. More, more torque wrench, wrenches, more craftsman wrenches, ratchet wrenches, dog bone wrenches. Those are nice. I've used those. All kind of sockets, ratchets, nut drivers, crescent wrenches, large pipe wrenches, 
you name it there we've got just about everything stocked here it's going up for sale and we're going to put this up today or tomorrow look at all these tools this is going to go up for 850 that's our starting price so we'll see what happens guys